the other half of a cigarette hanging out her mouth. She wipes the sleep from her eyes and feels the sun. Well, she whispers, a darkness has covered me. No, I can't see. But when the day turns to night, she powders her nose with the white lines, they take her away. But if she loses her grip, it's the end of her rope. So if she comes up fast, she better come down slow. That was just a taste of Come Down Slow from Pigeon Park's EP, Black Widow. So let's get right into it, guys. Some of the guys are with me here. What can you expect from this album? What kind of a sound can you expect from the EP? Uh, well, we, we've come from a bluesy kind of uh, or a classic rock uh, past, but uh, recently with this album, we've gotten a lot heavier and a lot more uh, focused, I guess. So, so I mean, I mean, if you've listened to some of our other stuff, it's it will be a little bit different, but I, I think you know with this EP, it's a lot more yeah, focused and heavy, and we like it a lot. Yeah. So that's good. Is there is there maybe a track that really sticks with you? Uh, is in like my favorite of the four? Sure, yeah. Uh, what do you test you? Put you on the spot here. Yeah, well, it's really tough. I mean, we have so, so many songs that these four are kind of like condensed. Honestly, I like uh, I like a song called Money Beats Soul that we have on it. It's always fun to play. We open basically all of our, our shows with it. It's just a straight banger. It's good. Yeah. Perfect. And you guys are all longtime friends, is that right, from Vancouver? Yes, indeed. Yeah, me, me and Hunter met when we were about 13 years old in a musical theater program. And then uh, I went to school with uh, two of the other bandmates who are sitting off camera right now. And uh, yeah, these two went to school together and we all kind of jammed separately and then kind of <coughs> brought the two groups together in order to form Pigeon Park. So you and Hunter took musical theater classes yes, we did. together? Well, it, it was like a community theater program, yeah. Does that come through in the show? Can can we expect that? Well, you know, like a little bit of it. I mean, uh, I, as a, a singer who doesn't play an instrument, I kind of have to uh, entertain with my my body as well as my voice and expressions and stuff like that. And I think it definitely has helped me along the way. So, what was the progression like from just being a, a bunch of friends to like, hey, maybe let's start a band? Well, I think we all liked our each individual instruments uh, growing up. Like, I learned guitar and. I took singing lessons when I was young and kind of the other guys got into guitar and bass and whatnot and hunter and drums obviously and uh, I think it was inevitable. I think it just took the right group of guys and the right combination and it clearly has been the right combination because we've been together for six years. Yeah, yeah six years. Do you ever, ever get sick of each other? Um, I don't know. It's, uh, you know, kind of a little bit I guess you get on nerves but uh, I don't know. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> yeah, you're able to put up with each other. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, recently you won a pretty big competition, the Vancouver Seed Competition, yeah. is that right? So what does that kind of do for you guys now? What what opportunities has it opened for you? Well, I mean, like, we are, we pride ourselves on being a very hardworking band. Um, so, you know, our progression it would, uh, if we weren't to have won this, you know, it wouldn't, it's not like we would have, like, stopped and, and given up, you know, <laughs> or anything. Was and But that being said, us winning this isn't like it's the only thing that's kind of, projecting us out there. It, it, all it's done is it's given us amazing opportunities and this huge platform that we never would have got before. Um, but we still have to work really hard. Um, you know, like one of the things we're going to win is, is a five day tour with Sam Roberts. And that's something that we probably wouldn't have been able to get on our own, you know? So like that's a huge thing that, that the Fox was able to, uh, uh, to give to us. And man, I, I have to pinch myself every time I think about it. I always forget that it's happening, but that's a, that's a big one. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. That is so exciting. And I have to ask, guys, where did the name Pigeon Park come from? Because that's fairly unique. I mean, I've, so, I've never heard of it before. Fair question. When I Googled you guys, I saw there's a park in Vancouver called Pigeon Park. Is that where, is that's where this stems from? Solid guess. Yeah, it's, uh, it's uh, like a downtown east side part of Vancouver where uh, people who are, are kind of down on their luck go. You know, there's lots of, uh, there's a lot of homeless problem, a uh, big homeless problem in, in Vancouver. And that's kind of where a lot of it is centralized and uh, it's actually they need they renamed it uh, Pioneer Square so everybody knows it is Pigeon Park we, we felt um, like just the name itself sounded nice and uh, we're happy to carry on um, the name as it's as a legacy on its own Absolutely. Yeah. and uh, you're from Vancouver as we mentioned earlier do you love to get out on the road you know come out to the prairies we love to have you uh, yeah that's yeah, awesome love going on the road and yeah that's what we love doing, so. And if, uh, if anyone wants to check out uh, some more of your music, 
where can people go? Um, we have a website that pretty much can link you to all that kind of stuff. Uh, it's www.pigeonparkmusic.com. And uh, from there, we have like a band camp. Uh, SoundCloud, a bunch of videos on YouTube, releasing a new music video on Halloween, actually. Um, and yeah, more stuff in the future, too, but basically that website will connect you to, to everything. Perfect. Thank you so much, guys, for being with us today. Uh, again, that's Pigeon Park. Their latest EP is Black Widow. Here's another clip from Come Down Slow. Girl, away, but if she loses her grip, the end of the rope, so if she comes up fast, she better come down slow.